Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. So today our topic will be copolymers. So copolymer is basically when we have more than one type of monomer present in a polymer. So the polymeric material which contains more than one type of monomer. It can be two, it can be three. For example, now here I have drawn a polymer that's called as butadiene styrene polymer, Buna S. So this is made up of butadiene and styrene. So the combination of this and this polymer, so we can get a polymer of this type. So we can get polymer of this type, CH2. C double bond CH. So from this you can get a polymer of this type. So this is called as this polymer referred here N is called a butadiene butadiene styrene polymer. So this is a copolymer because this is one unit present and then we have another unit up here, it's called a styrene unit. This is styrene unit and this is butadiene unit. So this is called as a copolymer and this process which results in the form of copolymers, it's called as copolymerization. Co polymerization. So this is your copolymerization where we have more than one unit present. Fine. Right? Copolymerization is kya hota hai ki the properties change. So there will be drastic change in the properties. For example, if we take example number one, if you have a polymer of this polystyrene, this polymer. So uh, for example, if you have polymer of this polystyrene, so if we have a polymer, we will talk about properties. Properties. So if you have polymer of polystyrene, so its nature is that it is a, a bit soft, thick. It's not mechanically that much hard, so it can be used for making toys. Combs, etc. Now, if we have another polymer, which is polystyrene, with butadiene, just this example, polystyrene mixed with butadiene. So that's it forms as butadiene styrene polymer, Mona S. Now, this polymer is mechanically very hard, so this is tough. It has a high mechanical strength, high mechanical strength. strength so this can be used for making the tires the automobile tri tires for example auto tires most commonly so the properties are basically getting enhanced a drastic change in the properties so copolymerization where we have more than one type of monomeric unit like butadiene styrene and the process of formation of the polymer is called as copolymerization there's a change in the properties the properties get enhanced sometimes very beautiful properties like polystyrene for instance initially it was polystyrene polymer it is very soft not that much used for making the household kind of things toys comps but if you have butadiene styrene copolymer that is a high mechanical strength now ab yahan important question hai ki ye jo maine dikha hai ki pehle yahan butadiene hai fir styrene hai kya uske baad fir styrene hoga kya uske baad butadiene hoga now what is the arrangement of these polymers so based upon the arrangement of these polymers, there are different types of copolymers, types of copolymers. So there is types of copolymers. Types of copolymers. Number one, that's called a random copolymer. Random copolymer. So random copolymer means when, for example, this is, we take this polymer unit as poly, unit A, we take this as B, we label it as A and B. So the arrangement is like this, if the polymer is randomly oriented. So 
So we don't have any arrangements A, A, then we have B, then A, then A, then B, B. So this is called where the monomers are randomly oriented. It's called random copolymer. Second category is alternate copolymer. Alternate copolymer. So here the monomers are alternatively arranged. So it's A, then there will be B, then there's A, there will be B. Then A, then B, then A, then B, then A. So we can see here the monomers are alternatively arranged in a polymeric chain. It's called alternate polymer. Third category is called as a graft polymer, a branched polymer. Graft means the pi one, the graft polymer, graft copolymer. So in graft copolymer, we have one monomeric unit making a polymeric chain for example here AA and then there will be a graft somewhere of a different type of monomer for example here so this is a graft this chain may pay on the other monomer unit is called graft polymer now the last category that is so the fourth one that is block polymer a both important a block polymer block copolymer So, block copolymer me kya hota hai? There are some blocks in the polymeric chain. For example, we'll make here AA. So, this is some polymeric chain of A material. Then we'll put up a BB here. So, there are small fragments of A. If you see originally this chain is basically A, but there are some block of uh, there's some block of polymer B, small fragment of monomer B in the form of block. This is called block polymer. Now this arrangement can be vice versa also. It can be like this. This arrangement can be like this also. We have the monomer of B present. And then we have a block of A. Sorry block of E now if this is the case now we have the block of A present different monomer so this is also called a block polymer so block polymer can be either of this type either of this type now it's my subsequent important is that the property is valley in this type of block polymer will different properties in this type of block polymer there are different properties now just I mean it's called label Katha deliberately E and B if you take example of a butadiene styrene rubber take the first case we will take where where your styrene has been made block so styrene is a block so B as a block here so your example I have styrene is a block in this uh, block polymer is case may you have the prop if you look at the properties is case may dekha gaya hai ki that this polymer is rigid it's a rigid polymer and it acts as an elastomer it has an elasticity so when we have this style in this butadiene styrene polymer when we have uh, this uh, styrene as a block so it's a rigid elastomer. Now when we have this A as a block, when we have butadiene as a block, the polymer becomes, um, the polymer has flexible property. It is a flexible polymer. It becomes flexible and then, uh, and it is also plastic. So in case it was elastic, now it is plastic polymer. So it has plasticity. So you can see that the block Connect karta hai dhu monomers me se according to the property changes. So this is all about in general the copolymers or the copolymerization. Again I will go to the board here you can see. So more than one type of monomer. So more than one type of mon uh, different monomers like butadiene styrene. So this is called as copolymerization. So then uh, the properties will change in the copolymers. For example, polystyrene was, it was very soft, it could be making for toys and this comb. But now once we have inserted styrene, it is high mechanical strength, can be used for making tires. So depending on the arrangement, it can be random. 
so it can be alternate it can be graft it can be block so block can be of two types when the block is one monomer than a different property and block is another monomer for example in this case if the block is styrene it is rigid elastomer second case if the block is putadiene then it becomes this is flexible plastic so this is a small topic i believe this will be enough as for your requirement of the exam is concerned this is all for the day